Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Darius from DariusCooks.tv, and I have a question for you. Is there ever a wrong time for seafood? And the answer is absolutely not. There's never a wrong time. So today I'm going to show you one of my favorite ways to fry up a couple of things, and I'm going to show you the most perfect pineapple pico de gallo you've ever seen in your entire life. It's simple, it's easy, and of course it's going to be delicious. So let's go and get started. So in this bowl, I have some lobster that I just cut and split down and cleaned, and I've also got some rainbow trout. Now you can use any combination of seafood you like. I'm gonna throw some shrimp in here as well, huh? And get the party started. I've got some complete seasoning that's gonna go in. I dare not fry up any sort of seafood without a little bit of Old Bay, or a lot of bit of Old Bay, so that's gonna go in here as well. A little bit of onion powder is gonna go in here, along with some garlic powder. And I got a little bit of Cajun seasoning, a salted one. All right, in goes a little bit of cream or buttermilk or whatever you have, but something to let the whole thing just hang out and get real good, right? Keep all the mess inside the bowl. So we just give this a mix. And you see all those seasonings in there? This is why I didn't season the shrimp ahead of time, because we're gonna dump all the shrimp in there like this and give that a mix. And that's gonna season up the shrimp really nicely. All right, so we'll let this hang out for a little bit, like a marinade. Not more than 10 minutes is pretty much all you need. Meanwhile, nice medium high heat, and then I'm gonna pour in some vegetable oil. Let's make our dredge for our seafood, which is gonna be simple. So I've got some uh, cornmeal. This is extra fine white cornmeal from Alabama. This is like the good stuff, okay? We'll do a little seasoning on this, so a little bit of Old Bay in the flour and the cornmeal mixture, and then a little bit of that Cajun seasoning as well. All right, and then with the glove on, let's give this a mix. Just to get everybody combined, we get that. Our lobster, that's gonna go in, and then we'll shake off the excess, and then we'll get it right in that hot oil. Lobster out of this oil. So we just drain it on paper towels, right? Now, in go fish. So that's gonna go next. So we're just gonna do the same thing. Tap off the excess and get it right into that hot oil. We'll just take all of this seasoned shrimp and dump the shrimp right into that flour and cornmeal mixture. All right, and then let's just combine it all. Okay, clean oil. So drop our shrimp in there. First thing we're gonna do is add in fresh chopped pineapple. All right, I've got some diced tomato. This does need a little garlic. To make this really good, I've got some fresh squeezed lime juice. To my lime juice, I'm also gonna add some oil. And then I just feel like it could be so tart. Once you have um, that lime juice in there, and then once you have uh, the pineapple, sometimes it could be a little bit on the tart side. So I got a little bit of sugar to help balance everybody out. All right, we need some salt, and then we need some black pepper. All right, let's stir that together. A Little bit of jalapeno, red jalapenos. All right, and then last, but certainly not least, is I have some cilantro. Right, this is it. Let's give this a stir. Because I love it. And then let me tell you what I did for myself, see. Mm. You get you a few tortilla chips and you put a few of those down because this is gonna be great. My mouth is already watering. There's some, mmm. There's no jalapeno. It's back there like, how you doing? Mm, so well. We gotta try it. I'm telling you, a brand new way to enjoy an all-time favorite. The recipe, you know what it's gonna be. On the website, DariusCooks.tv. There's two things I gotta tell you as I always do. Food is my life, life is my food. Until next time, I'm gonna wish you a happy cooking from my heart to yours. Mm, blah, blah, mm, mm.